what's up y'all so i've been debating on doing this and uh finally you know what i came to the conclusion i'm doing it <laughs> y'all gonna see what it is as soon as we get into this intro but right after that intro baby be ready because we got a lot to talk about we got a lot to talk about all right let's get into it hurry up <laughs> What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Nick G, the host, and today I'm back with another, this would be a podcast video. <laughs> this ain't even another one. This is the first one on this channel. You dig what I'm saying? Um, We getting into podcasts over here. Podcasts and um, uh, what you call it? Like open interview style videos, but y'all will see. Um, right now, I simply want to just do an episode because I want to go ahead and get this off my off my spirit you know what I'm saying like you know how certain things just be on your spirit right for one I want to put this out there because some of y'all are so um miserable girl especially on this channel um I just ate lunch with two I we just had quesadillas you don't believe me ask her she a grown-ass woman and so am I all right we got shit to do she got shit to do and so do I if I want to do a podcast by myself I can if I want to do it with two, I can. If I want to do it with TT, I can. So please, save me that bullshit. You can, you know what? You can do it. You're just going to be talking to yourself. <laughs> but anyway, I just want to put that out there. Um, So I want to get into this podcast because a lot of times I have a lot of things that I be wanting to say. And I always felt like, man, if you do a podcast, you should probably be talking to somebody else. But everybody don't talk to somebody on the podcast. Um, some people just literally have their own episodes and their, um, they shed their own light and, you know, eventually it grows and then you have people you do the podcast with, okay? So um, when me and two can get back together to make that thing shake, she gonna shake. You dig what I'm saying? In the meantime, in between time, let's get into it. Um, for one, it's so many things I want to cover. Like for one, where I've been, I have been working on myself. And when I say working on myself, I mean whole, wholeheartedly. The person that y'all used to know, I'm so not that person anymore. And I'm I'm excited about that because it takes it takes courage to change, right? I've already realized who I've become. I, I've I've gone through the ringer, you know what I'm saying, with my YouTube career. It's been five years. <laughs> A lot of people, you know, wouldn't wouldn't dare show half of the shit that I've shown or let y'all see the real side of them. I don't mind. Transparency is life. You know, you should let people know what's going on. Not everything. Some shit I'm definitely going to take to the grave. But you should let people, uh, you should be transparent with people because a lot of people are going through the same shit that you're going through. You know what I'm saying? And me, I know a lot of things that I go through, y'all go through as well. So, Recently, for one, things that I used to do or I didn't pay attention to or I didn't put too much energy into have caught up with me, right? I'm 32. And um, it's like, you know, and you're in, in a point in your life, you know when it's time to take it to the next level. And I don't mean like I'm a YouTuber, so... Since I do four reaction videos a day, I'm going to go up to eight. No. I mean, elevate in a way where it's different, where you're uncomfortable, right? And I am at that point of uncomfortability. Now, I'm, I've always been uncomfortable, but what I mean, I'm confidently lost right now. So don't get so caught up in the lost part. You can be confidently lost and know exactly <laughs> what's going on but you're just confident that this too shall pass and you will prevail you know and that's where I am I'm not afraid of it anymore I used to be so afraid oh my god like what am I gonna do and don't have, don't get me wrong I have times where I'll be like oh my god <laughs> how I'm gonna do this you know what I'm saying but I've, I've always been relentless you know so 
whether I'm confused in it, whether I look stupid, whether people judge me, whether I'm happy, whether I'm not, I am never afraid to change and I'm never afraid to grow and I'm never afraid to dive in some shit. You know what I'm saying? And that's what I've been doing lately. So I just want to sh- show y'all something. Cause me and Toot was just looking the other day. <laughs> oh no, we was looking today. Um at our uh Uber thing, right? And um we both started Uber because shit. You gotta make money while you while you gotta think. You get your shit together, right? So boom. We doing Uber or whatever. And baby. <laughs> Hold on, let me go. Let me go to the earnings. There we go. Bam. Baby. Can y'all see that? I made that last week. I, j- I just want to put that out there. I made that last week. Sometimes I can make that in a month. I don't have time for you two to play with me. So, you know, that's just one week. Okay. So have fun on the broke jokes. <laughs> have at it. <laughs> but anyway, so, you know. Uh, I was doing like Uber Eats just to, you know what I'm saying? When I don't, when YouTube ain't hit yet, I got to get some money from somewhere, baby. So, you know, I started Uber Eats or whatever. And I used to have a lot of fear of going outside, right? And I hated that because with the, first of all, it started before the pandemic, but really when the pandemic hit, it it got worse, you know, um, just outside is dangerous. I mean, hell, life is dangerous, right? But I was consumed in that. I was so consumed in being afraid of life. So, you know, I I got to the point where I'm like, all right, I'm sick of being afraid. I'm sick of um, living this way. You know, this isn't this isn't life. And hell, if I die tomorrow, oh, my God, the, how many regrets I would have, you know. So I decided and, and, and it may sound cliche to y'all, but it's not to me. I was afraid to have people in my backseat, which most are. You know, don't nobody want nobody behind them. I don't know what the fuck you got going. I don't know what you're doing. I don't know what energy you're bringing to me. And I, I used to get so consumed in um, energies and anything could piss me off. Y'all know. I got anger issues, baby. Anything could piss me off, right? And a lot of shit that, was, uh, that, that I noticed about myself, I was just ready to change. It's like, all right, it's time. So I picked up Uber, right? And I don't like people. Y'all know that. <laughs> I don't. Um, but I didn't realize how much of a people person that I, I was, you know. Um, when I'm good, I'm great. And when I'm bad, I'm bad as hell. You know, that's the type of person I am. There's no median with me. Um, so I'm either at a one or I'm either at a ten. You know what I'm saying? And who you get is on you, you know. So in the car, you know, when it's a, a customer per se, it's certain ways you have to go about things, certain ways you have to say things. You know, I haven't had a corporate job in forever. So, you know, the customer service side, I, I just lost. <laughs> I haven't had a job in, in years. So uh, I finally had to, you know what I'm saying, kind of deal with diversity, deal with um, what whatever was thrown at me with whoever was in my car. And probably one of the most... Um, I don't know, probably one of the scariest things someone can do is have a, a person they do not know in their back seat. But I was sick of living in fear, so fuck it, I did it. The first person, you know, she was cool. She asked me, did I have a mask? <laughs> no. Um, but I, I did, actually. I put on the mask or whatever. And I took her to, um, I don't know, it was about 30 minutes away. She didn't speak. I mean, she didn't talk. She was tired. I was trying to make conversation, girl. She was ready to go in the house. After that, it was murder, she wrote. <laughs> I've had CEOs in my backseat. I've had millionaires in my backseat. I've had thousandaires in my backseat. Um, a lot of entrepreneurs. I've met a lot, and I mean a lot of great people. And the reason why I started to do Uber is because, like, yo, I'm scared of, of everything. And... I need another source of income and right now I need to figure out what I'm doing on YouTube. I have to figure this out. And a lot of times 
I like to talk. I like to talk. I like to talk to someone, you know, amongst. I'm a social person when food and having a drink is involved. That is my favorite thing to do these days. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to your your <laughs> your nearest club. You know what I'm saying? I'm not about to be shaking my ass to your favorite rapper. So today my excitement is, bitch, let's go grab a drink and uh, let's not need to eat or whatever. You down? Yeah, I'm down. So I like to do that. But the gag is I can just do that with y'all. So with the the podcast situation, I just kind of want to come on here and just talk about my day. Now, I do that. Well, with mukbangs, I'm doing story times, right? Follow my mukbang channel, Royalty's World Invasion, um, which was supposed to be my podcast name. But just give me a second. I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to do with that. But, um, yeah, I, I, I'd rather come on here. Y'all give me topics in the comments. I speak about how I feel about it. And, I mean, either you feel, either you're going to agree or you're not. You know what I'm saying? It's as simple as that. But whether you do or you don't, um, I have a lot to say, right? And um, I was focused on the judgment for a while. You know, because a lot of people, especially on this channel, do not like me. And um, it's okay. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's okay. It's um, it's a beautiful thing to um, to not be liked. It is. Because a lot of, like, I haven't even met any of y'all. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I haven't, I haven't met any of y'all. <laughs> so, for you to dislike me, you know, that's a projection of, of yourself. That's a reflection of yourself. What I mean by projection, you know, people project their shit on me and I, I'm clearly a, a reflection of you. Like you, you, something about me you don't like cause you know that you do that same shit. And the difference between me and you is I can come to the internet and say that. <laughs> I can come to the internet and be like, girl, I got an attitude today for no reason. You know what I'm saying? My shit actually stank today and I just, that's me. And I'm cool with that. <laughs> I can sit with that. A lot of people can't sit with that. And they hate that I can. It is what it is. You know what I mean? For real. So. But yeah, though. Started a mukbang channel. It's a vibe. You know, reactions going to be reactions. Just started getting paid via Instagram. You know what I'm saying? And um, yeah, the last thing is the podcast. You know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, I'll be podcasting with Toot whenever we ready to actually podcast correctly. But in the meantime, in between time, I'm going to have moments where I, I'm going to do my own podcast. I'm going to do a podcast with my girlfriend. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I, I want us to talk about relationships and just, you know, um, things that we are going through as well. We're both, you know, transparent as hell. Right now, uh, we're working on individuality. You know what I'm saying? In, in a relationship. You know, and that's something that uh, we'll talk about on our channel. But, yeah, individuality is something else that that is being worked on right now within a relationship. One of the best things you could ever do. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, I just I'm stronger now mentally and I'm happy about that. So, yeah, I just, you know, just letting y'all know where I've been. And, um, yeah, I want to get these podcasts going, baby. So please, if you will, if you're interested, I know I won't have the most views, but I'm okay with that as well. So, um, you know, you know, something else, every time I'm on Instagram, I see somebody is starting a podcast, right? And I'd be like, damn, <laughs> like, which is cool. I am happy people starting podcasts. That shit is dope. But like, I can have one too. I got the background for it. <laughs> I paid for this. Girl, all this you see, I paid for out of my paqueto. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And I have a dope background and I have a lot of things to say, whether people like it or not. You know, if you come to this channel and you don't like me, well, that is crazy on you. But, hey, I'm here. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going anywhere anytime soon, God willing. So let's talk about some shit. You know what I'm saying? So I want y'all to put in the comments, um, if you will, if you're interested what you would like to hear me speak about. Um, if it comes to anything being transparent about me, please ask away. You know what I'm saying? 
and I'll come on here and be as transparent as I can about uh, how I have transitioned from whatever it was, you know. Um, yeah. And things like that. But I'm absolutely excited. You know what I'm saying? I um, It's time. It is time. It's time. So I hope y'all enjoy this. Um, let me know how y'all feel. Let me know who y'all want me to interview. I want to interview people as well. Um, I just need to figure out. Maybe I could just interview y'all. You know what I'm saying? I don't. It it doesn't have to be a celebrity thing for me, but I am a good interviewer, uh, and and I know that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm I'm a good people person, and and uh, to speak to people about whatever is going on. You know what I'm saying? So let me know. If y'all want to be interviewed, if you're an entrepreneur and it's something you want to say, you know what I'm saying? Let me know and uh, we will work it out. So put it in the comments. But I'm done with this video. I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. Don't forget in the comments. We out. <laughs>